Pittsburgh High School senior Tyson Weimers has enjoyed some of the biggest moments of his life in his senior year at PHS. Now for Weimers, who was on the autism spectrum, those moments are a product of a lifetime of work from himself, his family, and the Southeast Kansas community. A lifetime of hard work is paying off for Pittsburgh senior Tyson Weimers. All those things that might be little for some people, have been huge to us. In the last year, Weimers has won five Special Olympics medals, knocked through three extra points for the football team, and on the basketball court, beat the buzzer in the Dragons' final home game of the regular season. It really makes me feel good. There's no way we'll have that feeling ever again. I just, you know, you go through that whole range of, you know, what you have to go through and to have him, you know, show up in a game and, these dumb games we play can create, you know, these types of emotions, man. It was wonderful. Those plays and those moments lasted mere seconds. But for Weimers, who was on the autism spectrum, they took years of hard work. You know, autism is, uh, can be very sensory based. So there are a lot of sensory issues that we had to deal with. You know, early on, he was scared to death of things like the starting pistol at track and field day. And he got to the point where he could handle cannons going off at football games. I'd be lying to say that there's moments he went out there and I was terrified. For him to be able to be in full pads and a helmet, you know, playing football is huge. The fireworks going off at the football games. If you've ever seen Tyson coming out on the field, he's had his fingers through his helmet ears and or helmet holes into his ears. Yeah, it takes a lot of hard work to do to get out there. Tyson's an athlete and puts the work in to be to be successful and to make the most of his opportunities. He does that. There's nothing given to him. Tyson's earned everything he's gotten because he's put the work in just like all the others. So, you know, it's a cool story, but but that kid works for everything he gets. Tyson's impact goes beyond the numbers he puts in the stat sheet. Some people have that it factor. Um, they, they gravitate people towards them. They, they uplift people. Tyson's one of those kids, and you, it doesn't take long to understand that. So anybody who's ever met Tyson remembers him. Right now, this thing is about to get blessed. He's focused on golf, his favorite sport, and enjoying his final months wearing the Pittsburgh purple. Have fun being a dragon. While his high school career will come to a close, Weimers has left his mark at PHS. Every one of those moments was just, you know, off the chart special and you know, things you never forget. And Pittsburgh and the rest of the Southeast Kansas community has left its mark on Tyson and his family. I don't want any of it to come to an end. You know, he, that boy lives for school, and um, everybody from administration to teachers to coaches to the kids have made sure that his school experience has been awesome. Thank goodness for those beautiful people at the high school and middle school and even elementary school that let him go in the game and gave him a chance to be included and be involved, and uh, we, just, we just thank the world, all those people that let him do that. Tyson's family says he will find a job and start working after graduation. Now in June 2022, he will represent the state of Kansas on the golf course at the Special Olympics World Games in Orlando, Florida.